Kalonord is dead, Lord Malak. He has failed in his mission. Forgive me. The penalty for failure is death, Admiral Carath. They're a bit late on getting that news to him, aren't they? Not yours. He failed ages ago. Shall I hire another bounty hunter, Lord Malak? No mere bounty hunter can stand against a Jedi. I shall not make the same mistake again. My apprentice, Darth Bandon, shall take care of Ooh. my friend. This is the fellow that took out Shrask, isn't it? Isn't it? Why do you do that? And why does that look like the Lego brick animation from the old Lego Star Wars games? Look at him, he's got a fierce goatee. Fierce goatee. Vastla and bring her to me, alive if possible. As you command, Master. Master, as you command. We are off to Tatooine. Oh, my game froze for a moment. We're off to Tatooine, because we've got to do that thing in the canteen. So we're going to go do it now. Oh, what happened? Bloody hell, there were people in here. Did you see that? There were people in here. There was like a whole group of people. Uh, we are going to go... Oh, how... Who do I give the Gizka to? I can't remember. We're taking the droids, because I don't know... Because <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if they're useful in any form. We're just, we're taking T3 and HK, because why not? Um, yeah, I don't know. Okay, we've got Kashyyyk and we've got Manan. I feel like I am going to have the most fun playing through Manan. Just because I love the way that the Selkaf speak and their dialogue is fantastic. So I think... We're going to do Manan last, and we'll go to Kashyyyk next. That's not what we wanted. We won. Where is it? Is that the canteen over there? I believe so. You right, big fella? There we go. Anchorhead Cantina. We also need to go to Dantuin to get rid of the stowaway. But I don't know who to give the Gizka to. Well, now. What Who are you? Can draft do for you? It's been a while since I've had anyone bother talking to me. Usually it's some kid wondering what my whole racing days were like. No, I don't care about any of that. Uh, I don't care about your faded glory. I'm not here for story time. No need to get all confrontational. What are, what are we, sand people? You wouldn't find much fight left in me anyway. Yeah, well, I meant no harm. I apologize. I've seen your kind before. They make you feel big, pushing old men around. <laughs> You're all the same. Now Pardon? Me to my drinking. I, don't, I, don't, I don't think we have much to talk about. Not if I can help. I will force push you through this bloody bar. Uh, Furco. Well, the first ah. race for the game. I wonder, would you care to play? My name what? is Furco Nellis. My vice is Pazak. Pazak? No! Right. But remember that there isn't much fun on Tatooine that isn't life-threatening. Well, that's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for somebody who wants some spice. You know, it's that substance that'll make you keel over. Eh, who are you then? People in town centre have got it all the time. Come to Junix Nard's Cantina are long time losers and bounty hunters. Hut, hut, I'm looking for a hut. Well. Where do I find Please a hut? Any blaster fire to a minimum. Do you know where I can find a hut? I'm looking for a hut. I, oh, I wonder if they're in the swoop racing thing. Why didn't I just check? Why didn't I just check? A Twi'lek? Hulus? Hulus? We don't want Hulus. Turning over the spies to Lurs, he offered you further employment. Take a strange box to motter the hut at the swoop track. Idiot. Absolute moron. Just go waltzing into the canteen. Didn't even know what I was doing in there. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. T3, get your bloody act together, man. My god. I know it's been a while since I recorded some KOTOR. KOTOR takes a lot. <laughs> um, it's not a lot of effort physically. 
it's a lot of effort mentally with KOTOR. There's a lot to process. There's a lot going on. There's a lot of conversations happening. Hello. Oh, God. Do you not get sand stuck to you? Uh, what do you want? Handouts? No. I'm looking for... I have a box for you from Lurs. Box. Yes, that box. Be a month ago, you take a detour. I did not open the box, no. Okay, I suppose you're expecting some payment. I'll give you 2,000 credits for the box and you can run on your way. Um, I expect a little bit more for transporting dangerous goods, pal. Damn it. Huts are difficult, aren't they? Right, I... Do we need to go back to Lurs, or...? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, we can get out of here. What's the Juhani mission? Maybe talking to her about a past. No, you're all right. <laughs> you're all right. I think it's because it offered me to talk to her a while back and I didn't I didn't do it. Um, okay. Let's head back to the Ebon Hawk. Uh, should we go... Should we head to Dantui now? And drop off the stowaway, away or maybe we'll do it in a bit maybe we'll do it after Kashyyyk I can't remember who to give the Gizka to maybe we can give the Gizka to like somebody at Kashyyyk or Manan somewhere we've not been okay Kashyyyk let's go Da, 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 da. We've got a lot of Wookiee talk. Gonna be a lot of Wookiees talking. I'm just gonna summarize what they're saying and we are moving on. Look at this, it's beautiful, I'm gonna yawn. Oh, it's so beautiful, it's making me tired. God, you've got a false ghost problem, love. Yes. Another vision? The Force continues to work through us, showing us the star maps unearthed by Revan and Malak. Kashyyyk is a lush but simple and undeveloped world. I would not have expected to find the alien technology of a star map here. Uh, it looked like the star map was on the forest floor. The Wookiees of Kashyyyk make their home high among the Rosha branches. Only the bravest warriors dare to descend into the forbidding depths of the forest. If the star map is located far beneath us on the planet's surface, as our vision seems to suggest, it's unlikely the Wookiees even know of its existence. No doubt things will become more clear once we discover the star map's location. Okay, so we've got to head down there. I think we have to take Zalbar. Um, we could mix things up. We could take like Mission as well for once, or maybe take Calf. I don't know, take somebody different. Um, well, we don't have to take Zalbar right now, but I think at some stage we do need him. Who do we want to take? Do I want to take Calf? Oh, God. That's the million dollar question. No. <laughs> we will take him on Manan, I swear. Someone's going to have to remind me. Oh, dear. 
Greetings to you. Uh, while I am pleased to welcome you to Planet G5623, I do not see your ship on my docking schedule. The Zerka Corporation will see to your needs, of course, but there will be a hundred credit docking fee. Bloody docking feeds everywhere. Uh, what do I need to pay for exactly? Why do I need to pay that? Remote and expensive to maintain, the hundred credits given will ensure that it remains here for your use, of course. Correct fees, resources, okay, whatever. Very well, here you go. Welcome to Edean. Can I assume you understand their language? For a fee, a Zerka Corporation can provide a translator. I'm trained in the force, I'll have no trouble. He's got no no experience with it. We are not surprised, pal. God. Are there any Ephorian Jedi? Because that would be amazing to see. Like, with their body shape, that would be brilliant. Okay. Zalbar. Let's have a gander. What we got? We want to be up in your demolition. We want to be up in your treat injury. Oh. We want to be up in your demolition again. Let's up your repair. Do, 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 do. Let's give you rapid shot because I'm pretty certain at some stage we're going to get you a bowcaster. If we've not already got a bowcaster, I think we already have one, don't we? Vitality. That's what we want. Demolitions and repair. And then, what do you do? Uh, number of points. What am I looking at here? I'm trying to figure out... I wanted to see if there was like an attribute that affected uh, like security and repair, but there isn't for the attributes. That's weird. I guess we're going to up her strength a little bit. So she's a little bit more useful in battle. You know what? Zalbar's got the repair skill, so we're going to up her security. Um, oh, God's sake. I don't know what she's using as a weapon. I'm going to assume she's melee. I don't know if she wants to be melee. What is this? She's got the scoundrel perk. Uh, b -b 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 oh god, and that's like heaps of different levels of scoundrel. Extra damage to it. Oh, okay, hold up. We've got to look at this. So, sneak attack adds points of extra damage to attacks when the target can't respond to the attacker. The extra damage is applied to the attacks made from behind the target, attacks against stunned or otherwise immobilized targets. So, if we can go into stealth mode... But the first attack receives the bonus. Sneak attack only works if the target is within 10 meters. The extra damage is not multiplied in case of a critical hit. So if we can go into like invisible stealth mode and attack people with mission, she's going to do heaps of damage. Extra 6 to 36. That's mental. Let's get that so that she's getting passive vitality points. There we go. We've got to up your health a little bit. Because at the moment, not great health-wise. Uh, computer usage. Let's start upping that. I don't care about repair. Computer usage. Security. Treat injury. Let's go back down to here. And let's get that. I'm hoping that Evan can carry on like, like Evan and Zalbar can carry on the combat front while we're here. I don't even know if Zalbar can come down to me to the, to the forest floor actually. He might not be able to. And I'm hoping that Mission can kind of hang behind and maybe use range stuff and mostly be used for security. I guess I'm going to have to start upping her stealth, Anna. I'm going to have to start putting more into that. So, 
Stealth governs the use of camouflage devices to enter stealth mode. If a character equips such a device and activates stealth mode, opponents must make an awareness check versus the character's stealth skill, or be unable to detect them. Um, even if the character is in a direct line of sight. A character in stealth mode can set, disable and recover mines using computers and repair droids and open doors or containers. Party members will not automatically enter combat while in this mode. Combat cancels stealth mode. Stealth mode will not work without camouflage unit. Units of higher quality grant a bonus to the skill. So we've got to try and get a hold of like a camouflage belt, right? Oh, she's got one. Stealth dampening stealth unit. Sound dampening, not stealth dampening, which is arguably better than the other one. But we'll see if we can find some more. So, I don't know if she wants to be using range then. If she's going to be getting in close, we're going to want her to be doing some damage. So, by default, if she can get in close, she can do almost 10 points of damage by default which is a heap of damage but we've got to get in close with her we've got to what this is going to be interesting we're going to try something out here that i've never done before i've never done stealth in this game who are you comad oh god what are you doing here comad following me where is Komad from? Is Komad from Tatooine? Oh my god, he is! What? Uh, whose permission are you looking for to hunt on Tatooine? Okay, Zerka. Gain the trust of the native Wookiee population. Okay. Zerka from good intentions. Stay out their way. Okay, well, goodbye. Stay safe, Comad. Oh, I can't believe we met Comad. That's cool. Zalba. Kashik, my home. I should have prepared you for coming here, but I don't know if I've prepared myself. Prepared me? What do you mean, Zalba? I didn't leave Kashik voluntarily. Mission must have told you how I was fleeing slavers, but there was more. I am an exile. The slavers on Kashyyyk only took me after I was forced to leave my village home 20 years ago. Why were you forced to leave, Zalba? My brother made deals with the slavers and allowed them to get a foothold. I found out and attacked him. The fight was stopped, but my father did not believe me when I told him about my brother's actions. I was made an exile, disowned by my home and people. I should not be here. They will not accept me back. Time has passed, things will have changed. The slavers are still here, the stock is theirs. I doubt anyone has risen to try and fight, nothing has changed. I just hope I can prove myself to my people, it will be difficult to make them listen. So the slavers were Zerka. We'll deal with that if we have to, let's go. You'll be fine Zalba, don't you worry pal. We'll get you sorted out. Matan Daisol and Eli Gand. Hello. To you. Something I can get for you? Kindly direct your inquiries to me. Matan is merely an indebted employee. His opinions don't An indebted employee. So, new spaces have come to Wild Kashik. Please, look well upon the wares of Eli Gand. I live to serve your needs. Just be sure to pay cash. The interest on his loans will drain you like a diluvian fat worm on a hut's backside. First off, Hearts are all backside. Secondly, I don't much like the comparison. No need to get personal. It's just mm. business. Poor fellow. Oh my god. I've, waiting for his friends to return with my money I've gone to sip my drink and it's uh, gone everywhere. Oh, it landed on my thigh. I've got my thighs out and it's cold on my thigh. <gasps> I'm Evan. What do you have? Certainly, oh, cold thighs. I'm trouble with a trade god, it's gone all over my fucking shoulder and my chin and oh my god. Days. <laughs> oh, it's just a regular monster can. I don't know why it like leaked out the fucking side and went everywhere. Oh my days. Do <coughs> oh pardon me. Okay, hold up. 
Do you have a what? Oh, Gizka. Oh, Gizka poison. He's got Gizka poison. We've got Gizka poison. We've got rid of it. Brilliant. Okay. I do need some of these. We're going to take some energy shields. And I really, really want advanced med packs. There we go. I'm just going to buy a heap of them. Let's go. We can deal with the Gizka. Fantastic. Oh, my arm's cold now. I think... Is the Euphorian a merchant? Hello. I need supplies. What's available? Show me. Show me. Show me. Purchase local species. What? He means that they are slavers. Oh! They take my people from their homes and sell them to the highest bidder. Your current Wookiee seems displeased with the situation. Uh, Zalbar is no slave. He has pledged a life debt to me. Oh my god! Um, I'm through with speaking to you for now. Yeah, 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 we're getting out of here. <gasps> oh my god, there's just a Wookiee in the fucking cage right there. Holy shit. God, I love forgetting games and then coming back and having a fantastic experience <laughs> with them. <laughs> oh, it's like Mass Effect all over again. Good grief. I've been thinking about replaying Mass Effect, actually. I'd probably do it in my own time or on a live stream. I wouldn't do a full recorded playthrough, but I wanted to do it because I didn't play the Legendary Edition. Oh, here, Spacer. Zerka Corporation doesn't recommend traveling in Wild Adean. Katarn attacks are especially bad right now. Wookiee hunters usually keep numbers down, but I think they leave certain areas infested, just hoping a Zerka guard will get killed. Uh... I'm going past you. I paid the landing fee. I won't stop you, but you leave this area at your own risk. We're here to protect the company, not you. All right. You protect, pr protect. You protect the company. You protect it. I'm gonna venture off and go. Oh, what the fuck is that? <laughs> We've been charged by Kinraf, and I've shit myself. <laughs> Holy Moses pudding and pie. Scared the life out of me. Okay. God, you did nothing, did you, you little git? Not you, mission, the thing. Right. What is that over there? Are they enemies? I think they are, you know. Could you possibly... Move a tad I bit quicker. Shit. Zalbar's stories didn't do it justice. This is incredible. I wish he was here to see this. He'd want to see this, you know? He's right there. He's literally stood right here, Mission. Okay. You fucking moron. No one's gonna see Why would they have her say that? Oh. <laughs> the wind, the sound, the smells. I feel it all now that we are away from the spaceport. The walkway is new, probably built by the slavers, but I remember the trees. My village is not far from here. We're here for the star map. Nothing else. Understand? Just remember that this was my home. You are the stranger here. Yeah, alright. My father was very powerful, a chieftain. Okay, we'll deal with that when the time comes. Okay, he's just doing his bloody woe is me stuff. Can we stop getting interrupted, please? For the love of Christ. Okay, let's reactivate the droid. Uh, targeting systems. Oh, we don't have five. Leave it alone. It should now fight for me anyway. Shit! You think I can? 
Do you know what they get for a healthy one of those things? We'll work it out later. We've got company. What do you want, Spacer? I'm Patrol Captain Denno, and you're interrupting Zerka Corporation business. Um... Just tell me what happened! This Wookiee slave got a little rebellious. We had to put it down. Oh, good grief. You put it down. We're not animals. Does this make you mad, Zalba? <laughs> I bet it does. What are you getting at? Do you want these men dead? I would not need much encouraging. Do it! Kill them! We'll make them pay! <laughs> Blaster's ready, men. This fool wants to die. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Oh. Bloody hell. Zalba. Do you want to get involved? Oh, that was a good attack. Blimey. Bowcaster. Very nice. Okay, hold up. Let me see if I can recover these. Yes. I really, really want to test out. No, no, keep doing that. Oh, I can't grab it. Okay. We are going to try this. I want to see if I can one-hit that Forest Kinraf Stalker. No! Why would you do that? No! <laughs> Help! Help me! Help me, please! Oh, let me grab this. Wait. Oh, they're all running off. They're all running off. We outnumber them. Okay. Maybe we can try again, mission. No one's gonna see this mission. <laughs> Okay, just keep going. Do do. Do no. Do no. Do no. Okay, okay. Go. A 25 hit. Is that a good hit? Not really. That didn't do anything. I'm realising I have no idea. <laughs> Maybe stealth is not the way for me. We shall see. Should have brought calf. Oh, sorry. Completely forgot about Zalba. Let's head round here. I'll level them up in a minute. I've done enough levelling up for now. Get rid of some of these bloody flying kinrath things. Michael. Michael. Oh, there's somebody over there. Is that a Wookiee? Oh, look at all that Kimrath. Bloody hell. Mission! You doing? Yeah, just bloody leave it to us, love. Don't worry. Thank you, Zalbar. Nice of you to join us. Jeez. Okay, I don't know what's around there. We're going to speak to this Wookiee. Hello? You are not permitted to pass into the Shadowlands. Only Chundar may allow you to enter. Especially when you bring filth such as this with you. This Mad Claw has no place here. Who are you to question my place? You follow Chundar into the arms of outsiders. And yet you travel with outsiders yourself. Speak no more. Chundar will decide if you are permitted to enter the Shadowlands. Where is this Wookiee I need to see? Speak with Chundar in the village of Rukwururu. He will decide if you are worthy. Okay. <laughs> okay. I don't know why I thought that this would be... A lot less taxing vocally than Manan. God knows. I should have known that there would just be heaps upon heaps of Wookiees. I feel like part of me did know. And part of me just ignored it. <laughs> and that's fine. Sometimes you've got to just plough through.
Very nice, very nice. What is this? Slice the ID requirement. Primary functions. Uh, I mean, we've got enough, but I really don't want to. Could you? Gotcha. Damn it. Gotcha. Damn it. Okay, well maybe we'll come back later with the proper ID requirements, who knows. Who knows what the future holds. Ha ha! Lord Malak was most displeased when he learned you had escaped Taris alive. He has promised a great reward to whoever destroys you. Very good. But it's not going to be you, is it? Well, I've completely missed that concussion grenade. Oh dear. You've hurt me, Ed. Huh? What? Oh! Unload the force lightning! Oh my god, we're getting buggered. Nice, come on, mission. Concussion, throw the grenade. Oh. Oh no, I didn't want to do that. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to throw the cryobang grenade. Come on. We've got him. God, that were a tough one. We bloody struggled. Some short lightsabers and a bunch of crystals. And the same there. Nice. Double bladed lightsaber and some dark Jedi robes. Right, let's level up real quick. Put some more into repair and treat injury. Do I need to be getting that? Yes. Double bladed weapons. Don't know why I didn't already have it. Uh, your security is still naff, and so is your demolitions, so we're upping them. Fantastic. 